If you live in Lehigh Acres, posts like these on Facebook are nothing new. Lost dog after lost cat. I'm Fox Ford's Ella Rhodes, and locals here are trying to reunite pets and their owners with the help of this. I mean, I'm just one small person that I just drive down the road, and I can't not stop. I can't just drive by. Nicole Siobhan lives in Lehigh Acres and says several times a month she pulls her car over to help injured animals. I have gloves that are bite proof. That's the kit she keeps in her car, ready for moments like the other day when she moved a dead dog from the middle of Gunnery Road in 82. I, I don't understand how someone couldn't take the extra steps to take care of your pets um, and how it could be so out of control. Helping those strays in Lehigh is how she met Miranda and Michelle, who literally are chasing tail in Lehigh Acres, trapping and then reuniting hundreds of pets to their owners. It is an epidemic. It is out of control. There are so many. So we do it because um, it's like we have to. There's no one else doing it. Miranda and Michelle do this outside of their regular jobs with a team of volunteers who get messages at all hours about lost pets. They reach out to us because they know that we do this. They think it's our job, but it's not. But we have the equipment to do it. The most important piece of equipment, the microchip scanner. When they scan the dog, it can pull up the owner's contact if the pet's chipped. The dog itself can't speak and it wanted to go back home and the family did not want to lose their dog. Their biggest advice? Use a leash. So fewer and fewer pets become like the one Nicole found. In Lehigh Acres, Ella Rhodes, Fox 4.